Hey, we're live! All right, happy Thursday. Hello to all my creepers, to all my stalkers. Hello to all of my lurkers. Hello to each and every troll. Hello to the ever faithful, ever on task thumbs down crew. Hello to everyone who comes by this evening, and hello to those who may or may not watch the replay. Good evening. Happy Thursday. We're going to do a little painting with the acrylics tonight. That's just what I feel led to do, and that's what I'm going to do. And if it's just me, I'll enjoy my fart therapy. If anybody cares to join me, all the better. Well, who's here? It's Margie, Cousin Margie. Hello, and Paula. Hello, Paula. Very nice speaking to you on the phone today, Paula. I'm sorry it took me so damn long to get to do it. Sean, hello. I'm glad you came by. And all of you who were in uh, Tim's live stream tonight, thank you for being there for him. I got to womp a troll. That's always a good time. Hey, it's Jim Adams. Hey there, good looking. What's cooking? How good to see you. How you doing, Jim? Did you have a good work? Mumu might be a little bit late tonight. He had to do his parental duty, his good fatherly duty, and go attend one of his son's school concerts tonight. And uh, I think that is so cool. I hope I get to see. I got to see a little bit of it. I hope I get to see a little bit more. I hope you got some good footage of it. I love stuff like that, so. Hello, everybody. Thank you for being here. We're listening to a little bit of Strauss, the beautiful Blue Danube, done by the Vienna Philharmonic. And we're just gonna, I, well, you know what, Jim Adams? I can't complain. I got what I needed. My, I got my, uh, money on my card today like they said it was going to be so I uh, got to go to Walmart and get what I needed for Diana and picked up a few other little things uh, I treated Diana to, to big boy <laughs> so she had the chicken and fries kids meal she was happy about that Paula I wish you were too and I do hope you get to see that uh, holistic uh, natural medicine guy that you were telling me about on the phone. Jim Brentar, hello! How are you tonight, Mr. Brentar? Are you wanting to go live tonight, sir? If you are, just let me know it. Mumu gonna be a little bit late, so don't worry about that. He's he's okay. He got to see his son Xavier uh, do a school concert thing tonight, a band thing, so yeah, everybody keep praying for uh, high of truth, Paula, that uh, she's got walking pneumonia, and that ain't no damn fun. That's horrible. So, uh, if you have any uh, natural remedies, uh, anything that might help, I talked to her today on the phone for the very first time and offered my suggestions of, of garlic, which is a natural antibiotic and antibacterial and antiseptic, uh, also antifungal. Um, elderberry is really good for kicking ass of, of infections. So is lemon. I said drink lots and lots of lemon water. Um, so if you've got some some tips, uh, pass them on to our beloved Hyatt Truth Paula, please. I'm going to prepare and get some colors ready. We're going to do this in true MFJ style and get the old 50 cent containers of acrylic paint <laughs> ready to rock and roll. I'm not in a big hurry tonight. If I take my time a little bit, maybe that'll buy a little time, so maybe Moon will be able to make it or not. I don't know, so we'll see. I'm glad you guys are all here. Thank you for joining me. I think we're just gonna do an abstract tonight. just play around with some brushes that I don't normally play with is my plan so we're just gonna play with brushes tonight and explore how they work on the canvas here you know me I usually work with what the teeny tiny 
microscopic chisel, but tonight we're going to use the bigger brushes that I usually hide from, so. <laughs> and I'm just preparing my, I don't have a stone, I don't need a stone, what I do have to put my paints, yeah, we love abstract, don't we, Mr. Brentar? So, and hello to Mary Kay, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to be a great big bitch and not say hello to you, Mary Kay, lots of love to you. You guys, what did you have for dinner tonight, Mr. Brentar? Here, I don't have a, a stone, but I do have a cake pan, which also serves the purpose of the palette very, very well. There's Stoner's Sasquatch painting. I have to get to him. Well, it's Trailer Park Guy. It's Brad TPG's World. Everybody say hello to Brad, Trailer Park Guy, TPG's World. Good to see you, Brad. Thank you for popping on in. I'm sorry I couldn't stay very long the other day, hon, but I had to at least pop in and say hello. Uh, one of the, the channels that helped me along when I first came on the scene would be Trailer Park Guy. Thank you so much. Hey, hey, Brad, I'm trying to learn to dance the, the Madison. <laughs> I keep watching that scene from Hairspray over and over and over, and I am going to learn that from dance. You just wait and see. <laughs> but yeah, check each other out. I'm sure some of you remember seeing Brad, Trailer Park Guy. Check him out. He's uh, very helpful, very... Uh, very much a theater person like me uh so i loved talking to brad and just hearing him talk about the theater it just it makes me feel good but i remember the time you gave the theater tour and i just cried my eyes out i couldn't stay because it was just oh my god hey how's waffles how's waffles the dog that's his little doggy well mary Kay, hello again to mary Kay, mr brentar <laughs> yes, you didn't have to do the dance when you played Mama. Brad played the Mama in Hairspray. Tracy turned Brad's Mama. But I would, wouldn't mind playing that part, but I think I'd rather be Mr. Pinky. <laughs> I want to run the hefty hideaway. <laughs> Tim Holmes, hello. Good to see you. All right, do uh, talk amongst yourselves. I'm getting my paints prepared on my palette. We're just going to do an abstract tonight, and we're going to, I'm going to make myself paint with brushes that I don't normally use, big ones that, that Mumu would like that, you know, that I usually don't use, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm just prepping the palette. Good to see all of you. Brad, I can't wait until Project Dorton and Dennis, or Dennis, Douglas, excuse me, <clears throat> come and visit you. And I hope you get video this time. Oh my God. Talk about an epic meetup with those three and shit. Nobody got a damn bit of video. <laughs> I, I wish, man. Oh, you're, that was who, you're, who answered the phone? What's his name, Ian? I didn't quite catch it. Pardon me if I'm senile. What is this shit? Sorry, an ad just popped in, up in the middle of this beautiful music. Oh, damn you. Okay, there we go. That's better. That, that was your roommate, Ian? I, I don't remember if I said his name right or not. Well, anyway, do tell him hello. I don't feel very sexy, but I'm glad he liked my voice, so thank you. I'm not slacking off here. <laughs> Well, well, who is this Ian? Tell me more about him. I never heard of an Ian living with you before. Who is he? How old is he? Where is he at? What, what's the story with Ian? What's he look like? Does he look like Old Stoner? Does he look like Blind Views? Does he look like... <laughs> what's he look like? Does he look like Mr. Brentar? Well, Troy, hello. Thank you for coming on in, Troy. Lots of love to you. Your last Bible verse that you posted, wonderful. As always, exactly the one that I need to hear right at the right time. Everybody say hello to Troy, the soldier poet. And I can't, when's that fiery poem coming out, Troy? When, where's that at? Um, Brad, I'm just doing YouTube. I don't have any other uh, software 
downloaded or apps to to stream from um i've over a thousand so uh, i didn't go live until i hit a thousand is and that was before that crazy rule it was like just a few subs away from a thousand uh, my goal was to not go live until i hit 1k and that's when i did my first stream and you should go watch it brad at least the first three minutes because i sing um some sondheim i sing i'm still here and i'd love for you to hear me sing that so take a trip back in time and check that out my very first live stream ever called hello or no it's called hi i think it's just called hi there or something i don't know it's my first one uh, i look fat as a cow but whatever hey i pick my butt thank you i pick my butt i'm so sorry i have got to get you your shit mailed out jesus what is my problem uh, just a lot going on i have not forgotten you and you know i've come by and shown you love in your live streams there i pick my butt Thank you for coming on in, and I'll make sure to remind Moo Moo, Mr. Mark Fun Jones, to get you some stickers sent out as well. So, did you see that one, Brett? Okay, good. I'm glad you got to hear me sing that. Good to see you. I pick my butt. He's got an excellent sticker that I, it's, I just love it. <laughs> Wait, I can't wait to get the frame with the UV glass and the um, acid-free paper to put my autographed and most prized and rare stickers uh, in with the rosy sticker. So and when that happens, uh, you guys will all know it. So <laughs> that's okay. I picked my butt. Don't worry. And speaking of stoner, where you're, where you're, um, were your ears burning stoner? I was just talking about you. How are you, honey? Good to see you. I am going to just mess around and do the mess around. And since we're going to do mess around, why don't we play the song, do the mess around? If I can find it, I know it's in one of my painting playlists. And it's Ox! Woo! Oh my goodness, did I just see right? Angel Munez. Hey, Angel, love you too. Been a hot minute. How are you, Angel? Hey, uh, Brad's here, Angel. They know each other. Glad and well, I talked to Brad's about hairspray, so we're gonna do the Madison now. Then we'll do the mess around, maybe if I can find it in my list. Oh, these damn commercials makes you want to drink. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna learn this dance, Brad. I'm determined. I haven't been getting in trouble for playing the Madison from Hairspray. They let me do it so far, so so we'll do it again. Where did you see it first, kids? The Corny Collins Show. It's Madison time, yep. I want to do this dance so bad I can't stand it. I was trying it in my kitchen today. I'll get there. Okay. I'm just prepping my paints, people. Oh, you dance better than all uh oh, I got a little, little problem with the paint here. There we go. So we're just going to mess around and get the big brushes out that I don't normally use and just see what happens. Let's see, where's a big, fat, obnoxious brush that I don't like very much? Here we go. Big saw. Well, hello. Dancing on the table. Who's dancing on the table? Uh, that would be Bo Star, and I didn't see Bo Star come in tonight. But I'm sure he's dancing on the table. There in old Ireland. That's as he's prone to do. Getting buzzed. I'm waiting for the uh, the weed fairy to come by and drop off a little something stoner, and then I will go do that. In the meantime, we're just going to mess around with these great big stupid brushes that I hate. <laughs> okay, I don't hate them, but I was dancing in the kitchen earlier, Jim Adams. I was doing the Madison from uh, Hairspray. I'm trying to learn that dance. Hey! Kathy, swamp hugs to you two. Greetings from Ohio. I 
I will learn this dance. You wait and see. Yes, he said he was dancing in the shower last night. That's right. <laughs> no, I was not on the kitchen table. I was in the kitchen. My kitchen actually doesn't have a table. I'm out in the dining room. That's where I do my streams at is the dining room table. My kitchen is too small to have a table in it. It's got the appropriate appliances, but it does not have a kitchen table. So, oh, you damnable commercials! Get the hell out of my way! Isn't it nice when you keep things? Safe? Isn't it nice when you don't have to listen to commercials all the time? I think that's nice. Let's see. Let's do a little more. The strawberry alarm clock uh, never yells at me for using their music, so we'll do another strawberry alarm clock. This one's called Rainy Day Mushroom Pillow. What could those people have been thinking or been on when they wrote this? One only wonders. So, but I love this song. We're just gonna do the twirl. something last night I didn't really feel like doing because I was chicken but I got over it and it went over okay so we're gonna do something else this is what I decided to do I, you know kind of chicken to use these bigger brushes but I'm just gonna go for it so oh look at the little mushroom icon yeah I hope he didn't fall down too that'd be bad I need to get to Bo Star's channel and catch up on some of his tunes. And if you look at Bo Star's playlist, you'll see that he sang a song for me. Uh, there's a song for Nez in there, and I sang one for him. If you check my playlist, go back far enough, you'll see I sang a tune for Bo Star. So we've already done that. Been there, done that. I love singing for for my other YouTubers. That's fun. Hearing that, that uh, keyboard makes me wish I still had one. This kind of reminds me of Stoner doing the little orb bubble psychedelic thing that he's been doing. Thank you all for being here. Again, if you don't know each other, introduce yourselves. Check out each other's content. You never know what you might find. And even if you find something that may not be your cup of tea, perhaps you know someone that would enjoy what you come across. So you never know. You never know what you're going to run into. Ox, I'm glad you're here. And there, there who, there's Bo Star. Is he here? Well, Bo Star. Hello, Bo Star. Everyone say hello to the Bo Star. Are you dancing on the kitchen table, Bo Star? Did you, did you have to tend to your injuries? Are you even able to dance tonight, Bo Star? Are you all right? Are you okay? I don't like Bo Star falling down getting hurt. Oh my God, you stupid ads. Okay. This is for Stoner. Lemon pipers with green tambourine. How are things in Ireland, Bostar? Running around the garden. Ah. Well, be careful, Bostar. We don't want you hurting yourself. Just farting around with brushes that I don't normally use. Mumu had me step out of my comfort zone last night, so I'm doing it again tonight. He's real good at getting me to do things like that. His encouragement gives me the confidence to do things that I normally wouldn't do. 
<laughs> Tim Toes in the toilet. I love that song and I love Tiny Tim. <laughs> Play your green tambourine, Jim Brentar. Do you know this one, Jim Brentar? I do you know this song, Jim Brentar? You should sing a song with the Bow Star. Do a collaboration. <laughs> <laughs> Not now, Omar. Gosh, I love you, but damn it, I'm a bit busy right now, Omar. I'll send you a tweet. Oh, that Omar. You know how Omar goes up to the camera all the time and goes, give me a kiss, and tries to give you a kiss through the camera? When I first started watching Omar, I was kind of mad at him, and so every time he'd lean in close to give me a kiss, I'd, like, back away from the TV. I've told him since then, he laughed. He, in fact, he added me. The more I've chewed him out, <laughs> the more he likes it, and he actually he, uh, tweeted me, or uh, followed me on Twitter after I chewed him out one day, so... He likes the way I chew him out. Figure that one out. I don't know. It's blue and not green. Ah. Oh, you'll play Irish washerwoman. Bow star, if you have not be subbed to Jim Brentar yet, I you ought to be subbed to Jim Brentar. So then you'll know when he goes live and you can catch him singing a tune for you. How about that? I would love to see those guys collaborate. I don't care. I'd, I'd love to see all, all kinds of people collaborate. Oh, we're going to do the mess around. Yay! I don't get yelled at for this song so far yet. Oh, you know what? I got yelled at by YouTube last night for using the karaoke version of You're the Cat. The hell's up with that? Right. right. We're doing the mess around. You can talk about the pit. zone here peeps just give me a moment and I'll jump back in the chat well it means something ox when I actually get my blocked I don't care about those no you know emails that just are wagging a finger at me and nothing happens but when my video actually gets blocked and I'm not monetized I'm not making money off of other people's shit and I get blocked that fucking pisses me off I'm sorry it does it's ridiculous it, it's just stupid at least I'm finding out real fast what I can play and what I can't play but then the karaoke version of anything you shouldn't get in any trouble for This is Mickey Dolan's one of the monkeys off his album Broadway Mickey came out in the 90s and he has his little grandkids they were little back then singing in here with him he's the guy I met all the years ago he pronounced my name correctly on the first try he talked to me for like 15 20 minutes white pocket full of doubt look slap on a happy grin and spread sunshine all over the place just put on a happy face let's turn this up just a hair oh cool thank you kathy much love take care oh good Good 
good to see you. Skiddle em up, do beep up, do em up. Rip up, do scrap, do scrap, do em up, do em up. Well, take off that gloomy mask of tragedy. It's not your style. You look so good that you'll be glad you decided to smile. Pick out a pleasant outlook. Stick out that no chin. Wipe off that four down look. Slap on a happy grin. And spread sunshine all over the place. Just put on a happy. Put on a happy. Put on a happy. Put on a happy face. Oh, I used to sing this in the car all the time I had the seat back in the day. Yes, I did. <laughs> well, how was that, people? Did you guys dig that tune? I love that song. Well, thank you, Paula. We'll do another song here eventually. I just needed tonight to just do the paint therapy um let me put on a tune for you and i've got to answer this message please talk amongst yourselves let's see i need it back to my playlist something that won't be get me in a world of hurt let's meddle out with some chopin hello white witch hello just hang out for a minute i'll continue i just need to do my therapy tonight thank you for joining me I'll be with you momentarily. that text I like where this is going I like where this is going that sounds like something Stoner says in his streams and I gotta say it, it fits right now do you like it? I kind of like it too I'd like to add just a little bit more do you like just the single green dot in there? you really think I should stop? Did I reach the point of Museum of Modern Art where there's not much on the canvas? Jim Brentar, Stoner, your opinions, please. Less is more. Have we reached the less is more? I think we're done. I, I could go with that. I like that there's one green dot. I like that. Stoner, what say you? I'll stop right now if you guys... I don't feel... I don't feel a problem with it. I'm, I'm satisfied with it. Need more green? Just a little more green? Okay, is everybody okay if I put a little more? Stoner, what do you think, man? A little more green? Just a little bit more? Not much? Maybe one or two more? Okay, let's do that, and then we'll call it quits. I don't want to mud it up and fuck it up and cloud it up. We all know what happened. Turn into to poop, and it'll turn into Stoner's poop movement. <laughs> this is what happened in his street. <laughs> I liked it, Stoner. You took the the poop and ran with it, man. <laughs> Angel Bulldog. Hey, did you catch Richie's video? Did you see his live stream last night, man? I had to hang out with Moo and then I had to jump from Moo to uh, to his stream. Good to see you. Well, we'll hold it up here. Okay, let's fly our rolling drone. Again, do check my beautiful friend Roland Orzabal's uh, other channel, Fly Right Drone, is in the Wright Brothers. He does beautiful, beautiful drone flying footage, and he puts more than appropriate beautiful music to his footage. If you're into that kind of thing or know someone who is, please do check out Fly Right Drones. Tell him Nez sent you. He'll know. <laughs> 
He knows my name. He knows who I am. I know you were poop scraping last <laughs> Anybody missed Stoner's uh, video or live stream last night, do check the replay out and you'll find out what all the poop scraping talk is about. But he took that poop and he turned around and turned it into just the most beautiful... You know, you need poop to make flowers grow. And boy, did he last night. So, yeah, it was fun. And Mr. Brentar was there. He doesn't often show up in Stoner's late night streams. And there was the Brentar. I was so happy to see you there, Jim. It was fun. Yeah, had it all over your hands. It happens. This is the last dot of green. And then I'm going to stop. I don't want to fuck it up. I don't want to do any poop scraping tonight. I've scraped enough poop today. Thank you very much. There. How about that? Let's this up just a little bit so you can see. Oh, Jack Sparrow, you just better back off. I love you. Just back off. Okay. There we go. Yes, Angel, I did. Yes, I did. I watch all of Richie's stuff, including Jailbreak Overlander stuff. He's subbed to me under his Jailbreak Overlander channel, too. <laughs> yeah. Shell yeah. Richie's one of my subs. <laughs> and he follows me on Twitter. Moo I just finished up, Moo Stoner's telling me not to turn it into poop like, like uh, he did last night in his stream. You made it. Yes, honey, I love you. I'm glad you made it. Thank you for sending me the beautiful footage just for a moment. Still, I love things like that. I love encouraging our kids and seeing our kids what they do and being creative and artistic and musical. What do you think? Mumu, does this look done to you? I like it. I like it. Stoner, I think, likes it. Jim Brentar approves. If my fart club companions agree, then I agree as well. I think we're just going to stop right there. Yeah, yeah, you got to get active, Angel. You got to bark at those Illuminati sons of bitches and give them what for. Yes, do you think so? Guys, is this okay? Am I done? I feel like I could be done. Oh, like balloons. Yeah, it's, it's happy balloons. I was kind of doing it for you, Mumu. I was taking, you made me step out of my comfort zone last night, Mark. And so I did it tonight using my big fat brushes that I hate and I don't usually use. So. <laughs> Stepping out of my comfort zone worked well last night. So I did it again tonight. Thank you, Cousin Margie. Thank you. Yeah, me neither, Angel. Me neither. Keep that full armor on. Stay prayed up. Uh, Richie's going camping, I guess. He's going to meet some uh, some ex-military uh, peeps uh, and go camping and stuff. So pray for him as always. Ooh, that'd be nice, Jim Brentar. That'd be great. Thank you, Ox. I love it. I still have something to send to you, too, Ox. I got a lot to send to a lot of people. So many of you have been so generous and kind and sending beautiful things and wonderful things. And I need to get organized and send things back. So, yes, everybody say hi to Angel. She's one of my Richie from Boston peeps. But I like it. Thank you, Mumu, for popping in. I hope you had a good time at Xavier's band concert. So, I love going to stuff like that. I love seeing kids doing things like that. Oh, you're pumping gas and having ice cream. Oh, that's so cool. I might go live a little bit later, too, since I don't have to work tomorrow. Diana's going to stay home with me. Um, you know, I got to keep working on making sure that everything's washed, that her hair has been gone through and gone through. It's going to take a couple times just for me to be satisfied that it's totally taken care of. But so far, so good. So, But I like this. We're going to leave it. <laughs> it's better than pumping ice cream. <laughs> That'll be later when he goes to the bathroom, Jim. It'll be coming out the other end like soft serve, I'm sure. <laughs> oh, my God. 
Oh, I do hope, Mumu, that you got a little more footage that you can share if you're so moved to share it. I'm open to watch it. You know I love that stuff. I eat it up like candy. <laughs> and Mumu, do check out Stoner's live stream footage from this night where he kind of... Well, the words poop scrape kind of became a thing last night. So you'll, you watch it, you'll find out what all the poop scraping's about. So. <laughs> it's big <the> ice cream. <laughs> oh. Well, I, we're, we're just about done, I think. I'm going to let this go. I'm not going to mess with it anymore. I've got a few other artistic things I need to do tonight while I have the paints out, but I'm not going to do them in front of you right now. Because some of them are gifts for some people that are watching right now, and they just, you know what I mean. I'm going to get while the getting's good while she's in bed sleeping. And uh, like I said, I might go live and just hang out with you guys a little bit later, those of you that are up. Mumu, of course, I know you're going to go to bed, and that's cool. I want you to get rest. But, um... If anybody can hang out a little bit later on tonight, I might just pop on and hang out and sit in the dark and smoke a bowl as soon as my shit gets here. So I love you all. Thank you all for coming. I'm just going to say that's pretty good for now. Thank you guys for being here and giving me your input. Jim Adams, what did you retract? There's no retracting allowed. Los Mauricio is here. And if anybody uh, is into our friend Tim breaking the shell, he was eating crickets tonight. Weren't they sour cream and salsa? Or, I don't know, some crazy ass flavor of crickets. Uh, always precious looks on the man's face when he eats shit like that. Mark was there just for a moment. Sherry was there. Um, a fake John, a fake Exploration Unknown was there. So I got to womp a troll. That was fun. I love womping a troll. So I love you all. You guys have a great night. Remember to love one another, pray for one another, check on one another, help one another. Remember to find your love victim for tonight. You know what I mean. Find that person to tell them you one way or another. Love you very much. God willing, we'll see each other again real soon. And like I said, I might just go on a little bit later. I also want to do it for some of my friends here in uh, the UK. Maybe Mr. David Yates, the UK's number one poet, will, will join us. We'll see. It might be like late, like 11, 11.30, almost midnight. So if I want to accommodate the folks in the UK, it's going to have to be that late. So I don't have to be up early for anything tomorrow. Uh, nope. There wasn't a Thirsty Thursday tonight? I didn't check that. <laughs> and by the way, go back and watch God the Good Ones live stream from earlier today. I saw the face of God. He lifted up his mask. He didn't intend to. And then he felt, oh, my God. And he, had to, <laughs> he freaked out and ended his stream. <laughs> so if you want to see the face of God, just check out God the Good One, his live stream from earlier today. I forget what the title is, something about single ladies. I don't know. But <laughs> if you want to see the face of God, just go check his live stream from earlier today. That was something. So <laughs> and handsome. God's not a bad looking guy, I just gotta say. So But who's as handsome as Moo Moo now? Come on now. <laughs> Lots of love. I gotta get out of here and do some other things tonight. And hopefully I'll see you tonight in a little later live stream. God bless. Love you all.